Not far from Barstow, California, and overlooking the ghost town of Calico, are the Calico Mountains. These mountains are packed with off-road trails for all experience levels, as well as a lot of mining history dating back to the 1880s. Today we are going to tour a chunky and rocky trail with a couple of tall ledges to challenge your rig. Welcome to 4x4 Places with a Jeep named Mr. Green. This is Duran Canyon. <laughs> He's got skills. To get to the Calico Mountains and the Duran Canyon Trail, head to Yermo, California, which is 12 miles east of Barstow off of Interstate 15. Take exit 194 for Yermo and Calico Road and go north for two and a half miles to Duran Scenic Drive. The road name is on a wooden post at the turn. It is the second marked dirt road that you come to on the right. Travel up the main canyon road and bear left at a quarter of a mile to get to the trailhead for Duran Canyon. This is actually a bypass for the traditional first obstacle of the trail. The gatekeeper, as it's called, will be another tour. Duran is a two and a quarter mile trail that was once part of the paved Duran Scenic Loop and was used to tour the historic mining area in the 1950s. If you are interested in an alternative path, there is an uphill climb to an overlook of the area at 1.2 miles. Regardless of the path you take, both end at the massive Bismarck Mine. The area you see here is only a portion of this huge silver mine. There are several ways to get back from here. If you don't want to backtrack, a common choice if you like a challenge is to connect to the Odessa Canyon Trail. The connecting road is a mostly easy one mile journey. That's smooth like a drone. <laughs> Most people take the bypass to enter or exit Durant Canyon. This is only because the original entrance has become an extreme obstacle. The gatekeeper is a monster challenge that truly deserves its own detailed attention. The bypass drops into the original trail 0.7 miles from the trailhead. A short distance from there, you will find yourself entering the Duran Slot Canyon. Unlike the Slot Canyon on Odessa, this one has some technicality throughout. As I've mentioned, these canyons were once paved but long ago, weather and time have clearly ripped that away. Looks smooth to me. All along the trail, you will find some tidbits of asphalt still hanging on in places. There's still some paper. Although there are only a couple of named obstacles, this is a chunky trail throughout with big enough rocks to make you pay attention. There we go. But the real showpiece is the Duran Falls. This steep, over four foot climb has an off camber approach. This obstacle has changed in difficulty every time that I've driven it, but it is always challenging and always fun. <laughs> Ten years ago, this was just one ledge to overcome, but nature has created a second, three-foot-tall ledge to scramble up before getting to the traditional fall. Seeing the way that it is now makes it hard to believe that this was once a smooth touring road. <laughs> He's got skills and a well-built Jeep. Yeah, you're either. The history of mining in the Calico area started in 1880. By 1881, the town of Calico had a tin stamp mill to support the silver mines of the area. It is estimated that between 1882 and 1896, a total of 13 to 20 million dollars in silver was produced from the area. On this tour, we chose to drive the optional climb to the overlook above Duran Canyon. This rock-filled climb is on the left about 1.2 miles into the trail. It climbs 0.6 miles to an overlook of a dry lake below and the hills to the west. Afterwards, another 0.4 miles takes you back down to the traditional Duran Trail. 
Regardless of the option that you choose, both will end at the Bismarck Mine. What you see when you first arrive is an area that was collapsed by the BLM years ago for safety reasons. Even so, the mines go on for great distances in every direction. Old mines can be dangerous. Please use caution if you choose to explore them. So what are some of your favorite 4x4 places? Please leave a comment below and let me know. If you enjoyed this tour, please subscribe.